YouTube, welcome back to our channel. For today's video, I'm going to be getting ready for our photo shoot. Um, we have a Christmas photo shoot today, and I decided that I was gonna do my own makeup. Obviously, I'm not gonna get anyone else to do my makeup, but I want to do my makeup on camera is what I was trying to say. First thing I wanted to say, this is like the second time we filming this. I tried to use the Kiss Falscara set. Um, if you are not good at eyelashes, I wouldn't recommend doing those when you have to go somewhere. So I'm gonna try those another time because I tried twice and um, I couldn't figure it out. I also don't have a mirror that I can like keep up. So I have, I have a mirror but it's at my parents' house still. But whatever, I'm gonna get ready now and take my glasses off. Um, I'm gonna do my hair and my makeup, but first I'm gonna do my makeup. If you watched my last video, I mentioned that I was looking for like a new, new, um, what's it called, bronzer. And, um, one of my friends, Lainey, recommended one to me. Well, actually, um, so did Claude, she mentioned one too. Um, but I was doing a Target pickup, and, um, Lainey recommended the Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer. Um, I used to love this, but I, like, didn't like the color on me because I'm pale. Um, but Lainey recommended it because she said, like, there's new colors now. So, I got it in light bronze. Um, I'm gonna use it on my, like, lids today. Just because I'm not trying to do anything, like, major with my makeup. I'm just trying to do my makeup. But, yeah. Um, so I just put that on my eyelid now i'm going to i don't think i need any other color on my eyelid in case you guys said no i'm really blind i really cannot see anything so that's the whole thing um i'm gonna put another color on my lid just because that one's like not noticeable um i got these new eyelash eyeshadow palettes and it also came with this like blush palette from Target. It was ten dollars um, for both of them. I figured, why not? I really am trying to like add colors into my eye looks. Not today because I'm getting photos done and I don't want to look weird. I want like to look as natural as possible. Um, just because they're Christmas photos. But yeah. Um, I'm gonna do like a little shimmer just to add some little something something. I'm excited for Vlogmas. This is the first day. I know it's probably like a bit climatic. And I love watching people do their makeup. I figured this would be good for me to just talk during. Just cause like I'm, this isn't a tutorial or anything. I'm just doing my makeup. Oh, also this ColourPop Pretty Fresh Tinted Moisturizer. 10 out of 10. Next, I'm using the e.l.f. camo concealer. It's the hydrating one. Um, just under my eyes. I like rarely do concealer. Um, I feel like I'm the only one that thinks that concealer is just useless. Like, I don't think it does anything. Um, might be how I apply my concealer. Um, but like whenever people have like dark under eye circles, like I feel like they never look any different. Hi, we should a baby. This is the baby. The baby. Hi, baby. Hi. Now I'm gonna use the butter bronzer for what it's actually intended for. Um, but like, I pretty much just want bronzer to like liven my face up. Like, I don't contour. I don't do anything. I guess that's what bronzer bronzer is. Like, it's not contour. Concer, con contour, bronzer, contour, concer. Yeah, because I'm so pale, like, I don't want anything too dark. I don't want anything, like, I don't know. Let's see. I feel like it's a good shade on me. What do you think? I mean, it's like nothing, which I like because I'm just really pale. I feel like you can tell by my video, but um, just in case you can't, I'm pale. Next, I have this e.l.f. blush. Also, I wanted to mention, we are officially homeowners. Um, 
we have had our first couple of issues at the house, which I feel like classifies us as homeowners now. Um, so the first issue wasn't really that big of an issue. Um, our heat wasn't working and we thought it was like a lot bigger of an issue than it was. Um, the, the thermostat wasn't working, which was an easy fix. We just had to change the thermostat. And luckily my parents had a Nest thermostat that they weren't using that like somebody gave them. So we stole it. Now we have a Nest thermostat, which is really nice. And yeah, thanks for letting us steal your thermostat, mom and dad. And then our next homeowner's issue wasn't really like a homeowner's issue. Like it has nothing to do with us. We came home on Black Friday at like 6 p.m. We went to, um, we went to Target. Um, we needed like great water for nighttime and also obviously we wanted to go shopping. And um, we came home, we had no power. And like that's fine, whatever. But I have never lost power before. So I was pretty much freaking out. Um, I planned my whole death. Um, I was like, we had to throw away everything in the fridge. No joke, 10 minutes later, power's on. I checked like our Facebook group, our like town's Facebook group, and they didn't have power for like an hour and a half. Thank God we were at Target. Then, sorry, I had to put my eyeliner on. No joke, the same day that our power went out. Afterwards, we went to take Finn to give him a bath, and we give him a bath all fine and dandy. And then after we get him down for bed, we go back downstairs, and I noticed my foot's wet. I feel like you guys know what's going on here. Um, there was a leak from our bathroom, which I'm standing in right now, into our like front hallway, which is like right directly above me, or below me, like right there is our front door. Um, thank God it wasn't that big of a deal. Um, Brendan's dad came over yesterday and fixed it. It was just like a loose thingy. It wasn't actually like, the drain or anything. Um, the stopper in the tub that like makes it fill up with water came loose and water behind it without us knowing it. So it was probably like, a more overtime thing than a like it leaked that time. Also, if you guys could let me know if there's anything you'd want to see during Vlogmas, please, please do. Um, we have Lainey and Eric and Isla coming to stay with us, so that will be fun. That will be like a two days of Vlogmas, which is fun. Um, and then we live right outside of Philadelphia, so maybe we'll go to the city. This is so awkward, my neighbor's right there. But yeah, there's like a couple things that I wanna do for Christmas, but if there's anything that you guys would like to see, please let me know down below, just because this is my first time ever doing Vlogmas, which is insane because um, even though like, I just started back on YouTube, this is like, the 11th, 12th year that I've filmed videos, which is insane to me that like, I started when I was so young. But yeah, this is the first year I've ever done Vlogmas, which is insane. Um, I'm really nervous that I'm not going to keep up with it, but I feel like I need to like not have that attitude about it. One thing I definitely want to do in Vlogmas is go to Ikea. Has absolutely nothing to do with Vlogmas, but I want to get a tall mirror because we don't have one and it's kind of hard to see what we're looking like every day. That's all for my makeup. I'm gonna do my hair now. Um, I'm actually getting my hair done on Wednesday, which is insane. Um, I don't know why it's insane, but it's insane for me because I never get my hair done. And yeah, I think we are doing copper balayage. Um, Brendan's aunt does my hair, so I'm always like, what would look best? Can you just do it? And she said copper because I'm so pale. Um, but yeah, I found some like inspo picks that I like. Um, I don't think I'm gonna go short. I went really short in um, March and I loved it because it helped my hair grow. But now that I'm postpartum, um, my hair is like 
super brittle. Like it breaks off, it does all of the things. I'm just losing a ton of hair. I don't know when that stopped because I'm like six months postpartum. Um, here comes my hair. I have a Hot Tools curl yarn and I'm really confused as to where it is. Um, it might still be at my parents' house. Also, um, anyone that like owns a house or has an apartment, something with like multiple bedrooms, if you had the room, would you get like a vanity in like your guest bedroom? Um, I mean, you could probably put it at our master, but I just don't know where. But like, let me know because I feel like I don't want a vanity because I feel like it's not going to get as much use. But then also like, I don't know, I feel like I need like a seat. Like I feel like I need to sit down to do my makeup. Yeah. So, curl my hair. Um, also, Brenda got me this new bracelet. I've been wearing like, I feel like you probably would have noticed if you watch my videos. I'm wearing this like blue bracelet that says Finnegan and he got me this for our photo shoot. I mean for Christmas, but um, he wanted to give it to me for my photo shoot because he knew I wasn't going to take off the other bracelet unless I had something to replace it with. But yeah, he got it off Betsy. Um, I don't know anything else. It's stretchy. We're ready for our walk. Oh. You guys go for a walk? Why do you look so sad? Where's that smile? Who's that baby? Me for your walk? Hi. How you doing? Is that mommy? You love mommy, don't you? Brendan, are you excited for our photo shoot? Yeah, it's gonna be fun. We're gonna go for a walk. Yeah, Brendan's running to the ATM, but it's like right down the street, so they're going for a little walk. Him, Finny looks so cute. But yeah, we're all super excited. We already did our um, Christmas cards. So these are just like for us. Um, I just wanted like a little themed photo shoot. And like we only ever do photos for Christmas, but I didn't really want to like wait and hold off for Christmas cards because I didn't want to like be rushing and everything. So. We're just using these and then we'll post them on like Facebook and Instagram and everything. Um, the backdrop is very Christmassy so we probably won't like print them out and put them all over our house but. because it takes like five seconds to heat up so like I'll just get dressed and then see how my hair looks and everything. I don't think it looks bad though. I think I did a pretty good job. I'm pretty proud of myself. Um, I'm probably going to brush my hair out after I hairspray it. I think I look fine. I feel like my makeup looks as good as it's gonna get. Um, now it's not a bad idea. What's well, a good angle, so some people. 
now I'm in the guest bedroom looking for shoes. We have like a whole box of shoes. I have these little boots from Goodwill actually from like five years ago. I'm gonna wear these I guess. They don't have any other black shoes. At one point had like knee high black tight sock boots. I can't find them. Um, that stings. Um, I'm gonna get dressed and then I'll update you guys in a little bit. Um, I just got dressed. Brendan came home. He got me the biggest can of hairspray there is. Um, actually looks pretty good and then I have like a little cape thing we're doing black and buffalo check red buffalo check for our photos so I'm in all black Finn's in all black Brendan's in all black and then we all have like I have a buffalo check vest and then Finn has a buffalo check vest and then Brendan has a buffalo check jacket so we're all like matching I don't know if that's too much buffalo check but I figure if worst comes to worst, Brendan can take off his jacket and then he's just in black and then he has jeans on. Does anyone else do their makeup every day? Because I'm really trying to get back at that, but I just don't know how to do it. I got some like fake rings off of Etsy because um, we got engaged to Brian. She has nothing to do with any of us, but... Um, um, my fingers are too fat. It has nothing to do with my, what well, was getting married too young. <laughs> my, my brain dead. This is my engagement ring though. Look how pretty. Did so well. Okay. So, this is my fake rings. I got them off of Etsy. They were 111 for both the band and the engagement ring. I will link it down below. It's like a two carat moissanite ring. I don't know if it's real. I don't really know what mois moissanite is, but that's what it is. Take my earrings on. These are just small little diamonds that were my grandmother's, my great grandmother's actually, that I got for my 21st birthday. And I still wear them a lot just cause I like knowing that these were my great grandmothers. I'm gonna go put on my vest, get everyone else ready, and then we will skedaddle. Okay, I am all ready now. Um, I got my mama necklace on. Now Brendan, show me what it looked like. This is my outfit. This thing's from Amazon, leggings Old Navy, Target. We are about to leave. We are hopefully gonna be on time. This is what Brendan's wearing and then jeans and everything. And then I'm gonna put my boots on when we get there because my knee again. But I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I hope you guys enjoyed getting ready with me. Um, make sure to tune in tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 2 and I will see you guys then. Bye guys.